Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Cleo brand bars that we have not tried in the past. We've tried some, but then I found these flavors at Meyer, and I thought, oh, we need to try these too. Um, so this is a chocolate Greek yogurt bar and a blueberry Greek yogurt bar. And mine is a vanilla almond granola and yogurt parfait. So Kevin's was more expensive. It was $2.19. These were $1.49 each. So we're gonna start with the chocolate. It has eight grams of protein. It says chocolate Greek yogurt bar in chocolatey coating. And let me go ahead and open this. And then I'll let Kevin open it while I tell you what it says. So it's like a wrapped, it's in a box and then it's wrapped in the box. So it says eight grams of protein. It's 150 calories. Live active cultures, gluten free. These were in the, um, refrigerated section at Meyer where you buy yogurt, stuff like that. Uh, we're the type of people who eat yogurt with our hands. It's nice to meet you, it says. Perishable, keep refrigerated. Um, 150 calories, I've already told you that. I touched it for a second, got chocolate on me. www.cleosnacks.com. Okay, so this is just the chocolate. It looks very dark. There's something sticky on there. You can even see it on the plate. It's very, uh, it's kind of wet. And it's uh, just lay down. And uh, it's sticky. I like it. I mean, it's kind of dark. Dark and sour. Mm hmm. It's more traditional, <clears throat> traditional yogurt. I'm used to eating the Dan and Light and Fit. It doesn't really taste like traditional yogurt. It's not sour like it's, yogurt. No, it's not sour. It's it's very, very sweet mm -hmm. and it's very creamy and whipped up. This is a denser, um, has a sourness to it. I don't mind it at all though. It is a darker chocolate flavor, but I think it's a, a solid bar. Um, it's not one I would buy. I don't like the bitterness of it, one. And I've never liked really sour yogurt, which this is. <laughs> yeah, that's that's exactly what it is. I think I can live with one or the other, but since but not it has both, <laughs> it's like overkill for it. Okay. And there is something sticky. I don't know what the is. outside, but it's no, your I've, fingers I've are going to get sticky I've if you're eating it. in the car. Just. I definitely have it on me. Uh, you might like this one more because it's not going to have that bitter dark chocolate flavor. Okay. Um, so he said what well, he could do one or the other. Maybe this will be better. I left for some of the chocolate in the package. Ah, this one has nine grams of protein and it's 140 calories. Certified gluten free blueberry Greek yogurt bar, but it still has that chocolatey coating. Mm -hmm. I didn't see that it still had the chocolatey coating like the other one. Oh gosh. These are just not for me. It's funky. I immediately wanted to spit it out. I mean, after you've eaten it, you do get a little bit of a blueberry flavor, but it tastes like it's like ruined. Like it's bad. I don't think it is though. No, it's not. I'm just saying it has that flavor. Like it, it is so sour. Mm -hmm. It's like it's been fermented. I mean, mm -hmm. it's literally like it's so sour yogurt that it's yeah, it's just... Ugh. But we did not have this experience the first time. I'm almost positive. But they were different flavors. If they were a sweeter flavor, these are just very, like, very Like, I think one was strawberry, maybe, yeah. that we had before. Um, that blueberry, it took a lot for me to swallow that. <laughs> because um, it is... Uh, the blueberry, to me, came across as very artificial. But also with that sour flavor and then like kevin said you get the dark chocolate um i just it, that one is not for me at all yeah. never again it's look when i got it up even close to my mouth to eat it i got a smell of the smell of it and i'm like i don't want to eat this <laughs> i literally like, thought that it's like i really don't want to eat this it smells like death <laughs> like i'm eating a, a dead rodent i didn't like it either so um Ugh. i'm behind him on that now, this, um, one looks good. this is the yes this is the granola and yogurt parfait I like the it coming. is um a vanilla almond but this is dipped in almond butter so it is not that dark coating 
It's almond butter dipped vanilla Greek yogurt, and it's cranberry almond granola. This is 200 calories though, and it's 10 grams of protein, gluten-free. Ooh, that looks so good. That one's much better. I mean, like, like ridiculously different. Mm -hmm. um, it actually has a decent flavor. Mm -hmm. Doesn't taste bitter. It doesn't even really have the super sour flavor, does it? Mm -hmm. um, that's actually decent. The granola's a little chewy. That's my only complaint. The mm -hmm. granola's a little soft and chewy, like it's been wet or it's been refrigerated. Mm -hmm. um, it's a little soft and chewy, but beyond that, it's got a good flavor to it. I agree. Kind of like oatmeal. That's the texture of that granola. It's like it's been soaked with... Like water. overnight oats. Yeah, like overnight oats. It still has a little bit of texture to it, but it's very soft texture. Mm -hmm. I do think it has a lot of flavor. Mm -hmm. It's very... The granola, I agree with Kevin. I'm still chewing it. Yeah. It's very, very yeah. chewy. You've got to chew on for a while, um, which is a good thing. Yeah, it's those oats that you can get in between your teeth and just grind them in between your teeth. It has a really nice flavor. It doesn't have any, it didn't have any of the bitterness that the other two had. Or, it, there is, the baseline of their yogurt is still somewhat, it, it's real yogurt. So there is a little bit of that tang to it. Yeah, I didn't get that too bad. But, not, yeah, that's what I was going to say. It's barely, mm -hmm. barely, barely noticeable. So I think even if you don't like yogurt, I'm thinking you could do that bar because it doesn't have any of the other uh, bad stuff. Yeah, the other <laughs> ones do. Um, I can't necessarily say that I tasted um, almond butter. Like it wasn't, because I think all your flavor is coming from the granola. Mm -hmm. uh, because it has the cranberry almond in it. I think that's what you're getting is all granola flavor. But that would absolutely be my choice. Hands oh, out of the three, yeah. Uh -huh. There's not even a question about it. Yes. So, uh, these I, these have probably been out for a long time. Uh, we always, when I go to Walmart, I always look, and Walmart just does not get new flavors in. It's like they got, the, they, they order the exact same ones every time. So, it was refreshing to be able to go in Meijer and get some new flavors. So, chances are, you have probably already tried these a long time ago, so you can speak to them in the comments below. But for us, the blueberry is definitely a pass. Awful. Yeah. And, and the chocolate, I mean, I wouldn't buy the chocolate, but. No, I wouldn't either. If I was gonna buy one, I would buy the one with granola, because yeah, it's just it's good. heads and tails above the rest. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.